Hey, my name is Dan. This particular video is a free video from my full course on HTML5 banner advertising using Adobe Animate. There are also free files and I've got some finished files that I save after each YouTube video that you can download from my website. Uh, I'll throw a link down in the description. All right, let's get on to some banner making. Okay, in the last video we look at adjusting the instances, okay, the children. Now we're gonna look at editing um, MC Bob, okay? Let's say we wanna physically change him. We don't like him, or the clients come back and said, it's not a space alien unless it's got a space helmet on, okay? Or a mustache, or a hat, or something else you wanna add to it later on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go through and edit it, and there's two ways of doing it. There's one doing it in isolation mode, so if I double click the icon in here, you'll notice that Bob, ends up in the middle of my window with no, it's kind of like in a, uh, the matrix. He's kind of all by himself and you can do your edits in here. Okay, and that's one way of doing it. You can see I'm inside scene one, I'm inside MC Bob and MC Bob kind of by himself. I'm gonna go back to scene one. What I prefer to do is double click on them in scene because then I can see him in relation to his buddies. And you'll notice that if I double click to go back to the scene one, he's got a bit of alpha applied to him so he's a little bit transparent. But when I double click it to go inside, he goes back to full um, you know, his full kind of original state. And that's fine, because when I come back out, he'll go back to his alpha. But when I'm in here, right, I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Okay, remember that's Command Plus or Control Plus on a PC. I'm gonna move across. And I'm gonna add a helmet to him by using the same tool. What should I use? I use the pencil tool. Go back to my libraries. It's gonna be a white line. How thick is it gonna be? It's a bit thick. Maybe down to something like four. Okay, and I'm gonna make sure that, I can't see, I'll drag it here. I'm gonna make sure it's on smooth, make sure it's on this uh, 100, and I'm gonna put a helmet on him. Okay, great helmet. How many times can I draw this while you're watching? You just want me to finish real quick. I know you do. All right, that'll do, there's a space helmet. And what we can do is double click to go back into the, I'm gonna zoom out again as well, double click to go to the background, and you can see it's applied to the actual original symbol, MC Bob, and they've all got little space helmets on now. Okay, so if you ever have to go and edit a symbol, it might be the logo that you use more than once, or it might be some type you've turned into a symbol. What you need to do is double click it on the stage, okay, do your edits, um, and then when you're finished, double click to go back, or you can double click it here in your library and do the same. Just make sure you, when you're finished, end up back at scene one and without any of these little extras along here. All right, that's it for the free video. It was pretty good, right? What I really want you to do now is I want you to go and sign up for my full course. Uh, I'll put a link in the description if you're keen. I have loads of other good free stuff, so make sure you subscribe. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked it. And yeah, how did I, good YouTube people?